Hello everybody, this is Ian Lamont, author of Twitter in 30 Minutes, and today I'm going to be talking about how to cut down the number of Twitter email notifications arriving in your email inbox. And here's the story. So I have a Twitter account, and it seems that every day I get lots of emails from Twitter saying that such so-and-so has followed me, or here's a trending topic on Twitter, and it's kind of irritating because I just need to concentrate on real email, not these uh, mostly silly notifications that I get. So here's how to change it. Go to twitter.com. At the very top, there's a toolbar. Click on the icon that represents you, which is probably your picture, or maybe you might have an icon or a logo or something like that. Click on that. It says Profile and Settings. And then select Settings and Privacy. OK. There's lots of options right here. What we want on the left side of the page is email notifications. Click on that, and you can see Control when and how often e uh, Twitter sends emails to you. Okay, well, they're sending me tons of stuff right now. Everything's checked off. I don't want that. One thing I could do is I could just click this button right here, and that would turn off everything, all the email I'm getting. However, I don't advise doing that because sometimes there might be actually something important that you want to see from Twitter, and I'll go through that right, uh, right now. So l let's start with the stuff that's not really valuable, updates from Twitter. Honestly, news about Twitter products, product and feature updates, tips on getting more about Twitter. I don't need all of this stuff. I've been using Twitter for a long time. I don't need suggestions. I don't need tips on Twitter business products, which is basically trying to sell me ads. Uh, the other thing I really don't like is activity from your network. Top tweets and stories sent daily. You know, are you kidding me? One thing you can do is you can just send, set it so it's sent periodically or sent weekly, which might be good if you're just starting out. But if you get too many top, top tweets and stories from your network, just turn it off by deselecting that box. Updates about the performance of your tweets. So what they're trying to, sh what they want to tell you is actually tweets that are getting lots of uh, views or retweets or shares or responses. That's important to some people. They may want to keep that activated, but it's not important to me. So I'm going to turn it off. Now, here's the interesting stuff. This, I think, is where you might want to think twice about turning something off. One is you have new notifications. Now, the thing about this is new notifications might mean that someone just liked your tweet or um, you know they retweeted it, but it could also mean that someone actually commented on something that you posted. And because Twitter is a social network where it thrives on kind of newness, if you don't get notified that someone commented on your tweet, you may not even know that you're getting someone's leaving a comment that's important for you to respond to. So I suggest keeping this one checked. You are sent a direct message. Now on Twitter, if you click on messages, you can actually you can actually send kind of, uh, I don't want to say secret messages, but messages that nobody else will see to somebody else you're following on Twitter or is following you. And these can also be important too. I've actually, you know, offered people work through direct messages. And if the other person didn't have this enabled, uh, he or she may never have seen that I'm trying to get a hold of them. So I advise keeping this on too. Once you're done, click Save Changes. You may be prompted to re-enter your password, so hopefully you remember what it is, but even if you don't, there's a way to recover your password. And that will basically change the types of emails that you're going to get. For more information on how to get the most out of Twitter, check out my book, Twitter in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com, and thank you so much for watching.